Lady Louise Windsor tipped to step up to help fill roles left by departed royals. Lady Louise is the eldest child of Prince Edward, Earl of Wessex, and Sophie, Countess of Wessex. The Queen's granddaughter was recently praised for her comments about her late grandfather, Prince Philip. Last week, the BBC broadcast a film to celebrate the life of Philip, who died in April at the age of 99. The film saw more than a dozen members of the royal family pay tribute to the Duke of Edinburgh. Louise drew plaudits for the confident way she spoke about her memories of her late grandfather. According to Richard Fitzwilliams, the young royal may now be being lined up to shoulder some of Philip's former responsibilities the royal commentator and film critic told that she and other less well-known royals may be needed for public engagements. He said, it may be that there will be younger royals stepping up such as Lady Louise but at the moment we certainly don't know with that. Mr Fitzwilliams was discussing reports that Prince Charles will pursue a slimmed-down royal operation once he succeeds his mother, the Queen, as monarch. Last year, Prince Harry and his wife, Meghan Markle, left the royal family and moved to the US. Mr Fitzwilliams said their exit, as well as Philip's passing, could mean thousands of engagements they would have worked on will be spread around other members of the firm. Speaking about a so-called slimmed-down monarchy, he added, this is a phrase that we have to decide what that means, it hasn't been defined. The point with the so-called slimmed-down monarchy, it very much came into being, in the inner core so it is to speak, at the end of that balcony appearance at the end of that Diamond Jubilee celebration. That of course was when Harry was still single and of course the Duke of Edinburgh though he wasn't there because he was hospitalized, was alive. What I think we will be seeing is some form of clarification of what this may mean. Remember, the royals are attached to some 3,000 institutions, organizations and so forth. They have some 3,500 or over 3,500 engagements each year. Now how that will be spread around in the future years, there's large numbers from the Duke of Edinburgh to be handed out. So as far as I understand it, Certainly that will be a matter for the future. The Duke of Edinburgh passed away just two months before what would have been his 100th birthday. The hour-long film in his honour, Prince Philip, the royal family remembers, was originally conceived to mark his centenary. When it was broadcast last week, viewers got to hear Louise's fond memories of her late grandfather, including taking part in his eponymous Duke of Edinburgh award scheme. She said, there was certainly an element of making my grandfather proud and honouring him by taking part in the award that has been so much of his life's work. I definitely hope I have made him proud. She also spoke about how the Duke helped teach her how to drive carriages, one of his favourite pastimes. She said, the Duke of Edinburgh has been so involved in my driving which has been so lovely although slightly scary because he invented the sport pretty much. It's incredible to have learned first-hand from him.